the leader in HD. This is 12 News at 10. Domestic violence comes in many forms and is often kept secret from friends and family. Tonight, a Chandler woman abused for almost a year by her husband is sharing her story in hopes it will save another person's life. Kevin Kennedy has more on a cycle of violence that can seep into any woman's life. Kevin? Yeah, Kristen Davis never thought it would happen to her. She is well-educated, has a high-profile job and three kids, but that didn't mean anything to her abuser, who is also well-educated and serves as an air marshal with Homeland Security. One in four women will experience domestic violence in her lifetime. Domestic violence doesn't discriminate. Just ask Kristen Davis. Her abuser was her second husband. 911 emergency. Yes, I have someone in my house who won't leave. He's not leaving though, or he said no. he was leaving, but you say he he's won't not? Leave. Okay. He won't leave. <laughs> In Kristen's case, the abuse started almost immediately after their wedding. It lasted 10 months. When you're caught in that abusive cycle, it is so hard to break free because you feel like you're responsible. Kristen would eventually get a court order, but only after a terrifying night in February. Kristen called 911. Are there any weapons in the home? Yes. Okay, where he are the guns? He has guns? Yes. Where are they at? I don't know. That was one of the most terrifying times that I've had, and I was truly, truly beside myself with fear. I was literally cowering in my bathroom. On average, more than 1,000 women are killed every year by their partner, and one in four women will experience domestic violence. I didn't think that domestic violence would ever be a part of my world. Kristen recently started a blog to help other victims, showing them there is a way out and people who are there to help. Kristen did get that court order against her ex-husband. He is not allowed to enter the state for one year. He is also banned from making any contact with Kristen or her kids. We're live in the Information Center. I'm Kevin Kennedy, 12 News.